to watch someone so close to you find someone who is their perfect complement. Drake has the same kind heart, loyal sense, and caring demeanor that Lisa does. So I've been trying to write this toast for over a year now. I wrote and threw out over 40 pages of notes. Words will fail to convey all I want the world to know about my son. Yeah, I don't know if they want the socks back, but I think everything else. Laundry, Bieber, Jr. Babe, <laughs> Drake. <laughs> uh, these are all the names that I've called you over the years. And I can't believe that today is finally here. I honestly couldn't believe it until I started about right there. Um, <laughs> uh, if you had told 16 year old me that I was gonna marry the guy that I happened to ask to prom, uh, I wouldn't have believed you. I am so freaking lucky. I mean, what are the odds of meeting the love of your life so freaking young? Through challenging times, you must stand together and offer support, understanding, and compassion. You must recognize the strengths of your partner and be thankful. You must desire to enrich the life of your spouse. I can't believe it's been nine years since we went to prom together. <laughs> It feels like every year has gotten better as I've fallen so deeply in love with you. I feel so lucky to have met you so early on in life. It's given me the opportunity to see so many sides of you. I've met countless versions of Lisa. We have the same girls. <laughs> From the high school dancer who I would stay up with talking to until 3 a.m. <laughs> to the carefree college student who changed her hair every two weeks, <laughs> to the driven master's student who would stop at nothing to become a doctor. Every one of these versions is special. And although each of them different in their own beautiful ways, their core values always remained unchanged. Through all of the changes in our lives, you've always had the positivity to make the best out of any situation. The sense of humor <laughs> that always makes me smile and the spontaneity <laughs> to get me out of my shell and most importantly you've always loved so fiercely no matter what is going on in the world or our lives i know that when i come home you'll be there for me this is what gives me the certainty to know that I'm going to continue to fall in love with every future version of you. The wife, the doctor, the mother, or whatever else life throws at us. I know that each side of you will just push me deeper and deeper into love. Throughout our marriage, I promise to give you the same unconditional love that you, sh that you shared with me no matter what version of Lisa you've become. <laughs> I promise to always be your rock through good times and bad. I promise to be your cheerleader no matter what your goals or dreams are. <laughs> I love you, Lisa, and I promise to keep loving you 
every day for the rest of our days, forever and always. You've been with me through some of the biggest milestones in my life, in our life, and I can't believe that we're just getting started. From graduations to welcoming my baby sister into the world, to grad school and working to now, I've had the privilege to see the first few iterations of you and over the last nine years, and I'm so excited to meet the future yous to come. You look so handsome today, but I'm so excited to have kids with you, see you as a dad, see how we grow together until we're old and wrinkly sitting on our rocking chairs on a front porch someday, reminiscing about a life full of love together. But I'm also excited to just have you to myself for a little bit. <laughs> Uh, through all the changes in life we've shared, you remain kind, loving, thoughtful, stubborn, motivated, <laughs> fiercely loyal, and most importantly, mine. I know that no matter where life takes us, you will always be my home. You're my best friend, my biggest cheerleader, and the best partner in life. You're passionate about everything. You believe in me before I even believed in me and have always inspired me to be the best version of myself and not lose sight of my dreams. You know me better than I know myself a lot of the time. You put up with my hangry moods and always know how to put a smile on my face. You're goofy and weird and geek out over YouTube videos about math. <laughs> you share my dark sense of humor and could teach a course on sarcasm. Loving you is fun, grounded, sweet, wild, and safe, all at once. You make me feel loved, beautiful, smart, and able to take on the world with you by my side. Today, I didn't really feel like it was our wedding because I just felt like it was, an, I just feel so comfortable and so happy with you. It's just every day is, every day feels like today. <laughs> every day feels like our wedding day. I promise to always remind you how much you mean to me, celebrate you every chance I get. I promise to call you out when you're wrong and get better at being wrong myself. <laughs> I promise to keep our life spontaneous, sometimes inconveniently so. <laughs> I promise to make you laugh. I promise to try to never go to bed angry. And most importantly, I promise to love you every day, rain or shine, through all the highs and all the lows ahead. You're my best friend in the entire world, and now you get to be my husband, too. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm so excited for a lifetime of dancing in the kitchen, kisses goodnight, and overusing the word babe. I love you, babe. Can't wait for the rest of our lives. It is with great honor that I announce to you, husband and wife, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> can't imagine your life without them. You keep looking for a son. Well, perhaps your wish may be granted now, because now I'm getting a son-in-law, you know? The dog couldn't believe he jumped over the fence. Right? <laughs> no one could believe it, right? He walks right by the dog, and he goes in and grabs tickets. Now, why was this story so important to you? Because, and I still on the other side, I still did not go over the fence. Uh, because it just goes to show the kind of guy Drake is. He trusts his friends to a fault. He's loyal. He's honest. He's the kind of guy that he wouldn't ever do that to someone else. So he believed it when Rossi said he wouldn't do it to him. 
I'm so happy that you walked in our life and you're you're here to stay forever. So I'm we're very happy and very blessed with you and your family and um, this whole you know experiencing of knowing American family that I actually like. <laughs> Um, and the thing that I love about Drake and Lisa together the most is that I've gotten to spend a lot of time with them in Boston at their home together. It's not a big space. You don't have a lot, you don't have a lot of room to get away from each other. And um, every time I am with them, I'm reminded that they bring out the best in each other. And they bring out the best in the people around them. And you create joy together everywhere you go. And I know that you will continue to do that for the rest of your lives. There once was a quote that still hangs in my little sister's room. And it says, sisters by chance and friends by choice. I am so happy that you found your other half, who is so kind, loving, respectful, and, expect, and accepts Lisa for her T.J. Max obsession. Uh, Lisa is wonderful in every measurable way. Again, li listing her strengths and accomplishments would take more than a toast would allow. <laughs> so the moral of the toast, if Lisa is nowhere seen, Please. just keep looking, she's somewhere sleeping. <laughs> and I'm beyond excited to see the next chapters of your lives and see, move to Connecticut and start medical school. I can't wait to see the life that unfolds as husband and wife. I love you both so very much. I wish you a lifetime of laughter, of joyous moments, of love and support through trying times, and excitement for all the adventures that lie ahead. To the happily ever Landry's. To you. I will be there every step of the way, okay? There's no it's could always come to me for anything. I love you guys so much. Congratulations. I love you. I hope you're having an amazing wedding. Um, I hope my stress was, wasn't in vain. <laughs> but I love you and happy wedding day, babe. And I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you, baby. I love you every day for the rest of my days, forever and always.